We all know that Obudo activities begin with the traditional Japanese bow, called rei, and ends with rei. Through the basic concept of otagai rei, we are able to show respect towards a person's character, and in doing so, establish a relationship with that person on mutual trust, goodwill, and understanding. In society, Ray provides us with the means of establishing a framework for interacting with others and maintaining social order. Everyone who learns Budo, whether it's Karate Do, Kendo, Naido, Jodo, Aikido, must gain a deeper understanding and appreciation of Budo concepts such as Ray. Over the past year, I've been dedicated to creating an organization called Budo for Peace. The mission of Budo for Peace is to bring youth from conflict areas together, to participate in traditional Japanese Budo, to learn its intrinsic values of respect, harmony, self-control and self-development, and to use these concepts to break down the barriers of ignorance and fear. One of the major projects of Budo for Peace in this region is to create twin dojos whereby Israeli and Palestinian children can gain knowledge and train together in an atmosphere of respect and safety. We believe that this project will enable Budo students to turn conflicts both within themselves and with others into positive experiences which promotes harmonious coexistence. Only with such interaction at a grassroots level will the ideals of peace become a reality. I wish Marco Sensei, Jean-Pierre Reich Sensei, and Kozak Sensei a successful seminar and hope to see you and Marco's continual involvement in Budo for Peace. Tudarabha.